Good morning, Mr. Ariel. Good to see you. I'm sorry that we're seeing you under these circumstances, but you've picked up some serious charges in Como County. And the problem is, is that you never, ever, 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 once have appeared on your own in the dozens and dozens of charges that you and I have had together have never once on your own appeared. And you want me to give you a PR bond? Judge. Tell me. I'm asking, give me an opportunity to present myself or report myself to the probations that you've uh, acquired my person to, uh, to be. To be. Uh, I have been, I've been uh, back and forth uh, between Harris County and Kamal County since the last time you uh, released me. I never got a, a chance. Uh, I just now came from Comal County back over here. I'm, um, I'm asking for, uh, to give me the opportunity that, that I may be able to, uh, to uh, report on his probation judge. Yeah. And based off what I am looking, it appears that these Comal County cases mm -hmm. happen prior to him being placed on probation. So they wouldn't necessarily be a violation of his probation. Alex, what say you about the time? He was placed on probation. It seems in May, if I'm correct. Is that correct? May of 2024. These Como County cases, they were they took place in July of 2024 and subsequently filed that same month. So July, so after his place on the probation. Mr. Ariola. I was I was in Comal, uh, I was in I was taken from here to Comal County. Okay, prior when you gave me that. I was uh, I, I was out that uh, I was able to to uh, I, I think I know what he's trying to say. He he's saying he has never been out of jail to commit these cases in July. But he has been. You were out. If I may, I, you were in aftercare, and it was probably at that time when you picked up the new cases. It's the same. If I may, if I if I may share with you, these cases are the same cases. Uh, or the same circumstances, just as, as, as the trespass. I know. Um, and I, I know it keeps happening over and over and over. They try to pick you up. You don't like it. And it just, it hits the fan. And then you end up picking three to four charges. As every single time this happens. I'm not a criminal, nor am I, and my intention is to do crime in the world. That is not my. That is not my way of living. That is not my way. What? What? I at this moment right now. What I'm seeking. What I'm asking is to get the, the opportunity to be able to to report and, and to do as 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 you uh, ask for the probation. Let me tell you one thing. Okay, hold on. Since 2021, you and I have been dancing. You've picked up an attempted possession of a firearm, possession of a controlled substance, possession of a controlled substance, failure to ID, resisting arrest, failure to ID, failure to ID, failure to ID, evading arrest, criminal trespass, criminal trespass, criminal trespass, possession of a controlled substance, failure to ID, criminal trespass, criminal trespass, criminal trespass, criminal trespass, criminal trespass, criminal trespass, and another criminal trespass. On all of those, except the last two, every single time you have done, time served. And I told you, on the last two, 
before you picked it up and we let you go, I said, Mr. Ariola, if you pick up another case, we will, we are done with catch and release. We will now do everything in our power to ensure that the trespasses and the failure to IDs and the thefts and the assaults stop. And we would do that by doing the dual diagnosis residential program. And I told you that we would continue to do it over and over and over until it stops. You know what's going to happen every time you wear orange in Harris County. That's it. I have given you PR bond after PR bond to the tune of probably 12 PR bonds. And every single time we've given you a PR bond, you never show up. No more catch and release. We now need to get to the root of the problem. That's what we're going to do. And even if we have to do DDRP five times. Listen, let's be honest. If, 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 if I was to represent myself, it sticks to the grounds of laws, of real laws, of what's, what's contributing to what's, what's to my self-being, my well-being, my person, the person that you are treating in such a way at this small very moment. It would be a different story and a different face for you, my friend. I'm only talking here. Stop. That can be considered as a threat. I'm just giving you fair warning. I want to help you, Mr. Ariola. I want to end the cycle of you keep coming back to jail. Believe it or not, I want to help you. I don't, I want to end this. I want you to get a job. I want you to be a productive member. And I was hoping by having you go to the DDRP and in aftercare, that would happen. It, it, I don't know. I, 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 I don't I know what happened. You were doing great in DDRP and we got reports that you were doing great. When you got to aftercare, I don't know what happened though. At this moment, the charges uh, from Kamal County, uh, I'm on PR bond. I'm, they're not even, they haven't even been, and, and I haven't even been indicted. At this moment, I'm asking that I'm given the opportunity to, to complete this uh, program of yours. Let, let, let the service play as, as it plays. There's a whole different county, a whole different position. Different so, position. Let me give you a little roadmap, what I was thinking. I'm having our chief district attorney here reach out to Como County to let them know what we want to do here about DDRP in hopes that they, you know, are on board with us. Those, they have nothing to do with y'all. There's a whole different, know. there's a whole different uh, I know. jurisdiction, a whole Trying, different county. I'm trying to let them know that we want to put you in a treatment place with us here in hopes that they're with us and it may resolve the cases over there. Can you see what I'm saying? I'm on a PR bond over there at this moment. Why would they care what happens here? They don't care. They, they're just on for, how, how dare? What idea is this from? This, I this- can let, I can let Lori explain to you I know, what we're uh, trying to do. I'm listening, I uh, did hear it, but this, So Ariel, if I give you a PR bond, you'll never come back. I'm not asking for a PR bond. I'm asking to give me the chance, the opportunity to report to the probation that you put me on. Give me yes, the chance. I'm, yes, I want to do that. Please. PR, yes, I, I am in agreement with you. But first, Como County has to take care of itself. We can't do anything here until Como County is taken care of. Como County sent me over here. I know. We're going to reach out to Como County to see what we can do. They got me on PR bond over there so we can take care of the situation over here at this time. This is what I'm doing here now. They, they don't got no, they got no business into what, what, what uh, Harris County uh, does with me at this moment, uh, with this case here. They have no business. They, they haven't even indicted me yet. I'm going to let Lori <laughs> try to explain to you what we're trying to do. What you're trying to do, I know what I, that, it, how, why would you even want, listen, you're the judge here. You know what's going on. 
I'm on PR bond over there. They're not trying. They're not even looking at my cases at this very moment. What do you want? I'm asking, give me the opportunity to report to, the, to probation now. Of what, what I, give me the opportunity because I haven't given the opportunity to, to report them to probation. When you say give me the opportunity, what does that mean? Let you out of jail? Yeah, so I can report to this. And, and Wincombe County, uh, because I, I got a lawyer over there, they would, they would alert me about uh, going to, if, if they do, if they do pick it up, if they even if they do pick it up, they would alert me to go to court. And, but till then, let me just uh, uh, proceed with the process here with the probation. Please, that is that is what I'm asking. I'm begging for you so I can get an opportunity, a chance to get get out and work and and and, and be able to to fight this uh, from the from the free world. If, uh, if, if anything, if they do pick up the cases, I could I'll be able to fight fight them so I can stay relevant to the probation here and and, and current with uh, uh, Harris with Harris County. I know that you're not going to like my answer, Mr. Ariel, but uh, if I give you a PR bond. You're going to ghost me like every time you've done before. I have history tells me I have your bonds now always at 2003, 7504, 5006 because you take off. You never in in five years, you've never not one time come back on your own. Why would you give me a PR bond? Can you, can you just not reinstate me to, to, to complete the probation? I'm not having even anything. We need to figure out what's going on with Como County. I'm going to let Lori hopefully try to explain to you what we're trying to do with getting Como County on our side as well, so that hopefully we can resolve it all. And I don't know if if if, if, if this is even like if would you even really care to understand what what Como County being in Como County what what it, what it has done to. Let's to do this. Look, I have a bunch of people that are waiting. I'll take more time with you toward the end of the day. I don't want to keep them waiting because they have busy lives as well. Let me talk to them. Let me thin out everybody here, and then I'll bring you back out and we can talk more, okay? But we've already spent, what, 20 minutes here now, and I've got a lot of people waiting. Let me thin them out. I'll bring you back out in maybe like 45 minutes and we'll talk more, okay? Sure. I'll give you more time, I promise. Counsel. 